welcome. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to make a cluster stitch. So I'm just going to be using um, the fabric of uh, the fabric sample I've made from the um, different stitch videos that we've been doing from the stitch guide. I'll put the link below. Um, you can just practice these on any 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 piece of fabric sample that you've got, or you can just chain. So you make ten ten chains. And, um, and then work into the chain. So you may have just a row of chains rather than all this fabric. It doesn't actually matter. So we're gonna be using, to make the cluster stitch, we use the uh, US double UK treble. So I'm just gonna to get to the end of my row. Yeah, and we're gonna chain two. And we're then gonna turn our work if you're using a sample, if not, you'll just be going straight into your chains. So that first stitch, we're going to make a US double UK treble. So we're going to yarn over, insert, pull the arm through, three loops on the hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. And we're then going to chain two just so that we can give ourselves a bit of space. We're going to skip two stitches and we're going to work in this third stitch over here to make our first cluster. So when you make clusters, you'll see different patterns will tell you to make either a two stitch, three stitch or four stitch cluster, sometimes even a five stitch cluster. And so we're gonna be looking at two, three and four stitch clusters. And the clusters are made by using the US double UK treble. And we've just made one of those, so we know that we can make one of those. So we're going to yarn over, we're going to skip one, two, and go into the third stitch. Insert the hook, pull the yarn through. So you've got three loops on the hook, like a normal US double UK treble. We're going to yarn over, pull through two loops. So instead of finishing that stitch, we're going to start another stitch. So we're going to yarn over and insert the hook into the same space pull the yarn through. We should have four loops on the hook now. So we're going to yarn over, pull through two. So now we've got three loops on the hook and two stitches have begun. We're going to yarn over and pull through all three loops to finish the stitch. And there's your first cluster. It's a little two stitch cluster. So we're now going to chain two, one, two. We're going to skip those two stitches and we're now going to make a three stitch cluster. Yarn over, insert your hook, pull the yarn through, three loops on the hook. Yarn over, pull through two loops, two loops left on the hook. Yarn over, insert the hook, pull the yarn through. Four loops on the hook. So we're going to start that second stitch by yarning over and pulling through two loops. We're now going to start the third stitch. Yarn over. Insert the hook into the same space and pull the yarn through. You should have five loops on your hook. Yarn over and pull through two loops. So you've now started the third stitch. We're now going to finish the cluster. Yarn over and pull through all four loops. And that's our second cluster. See, it's slightly bigger than the, th the first. Now we're going to make a four stitch cluster. So again, we're going to give ourselves some space. We're going to chain two. We're going to skip two stitches and we're going to work in the third stitch again. So we're going to start our first stitch, yarn over, insert your hook, pull the yarn through. Yarn over, pull through two loops. That's our first stitch started. We're now going to start the second stitch, yarn over, insert the hook, pull the yarn through, four loops on the hook, yarn over, pull through two loops. That's our second stitch started. Yarn over, insert the hook, pull the yarn through, yarn over, pull through two loops. We've now started the third stitch, so we've got four loops on the hook. We're now going to start the fourth and last stitch, so we're going to yarn over, Insert the hook into the same place, pull the yarn through. Yarn over, pull through two loops. So we've now got four stitches started in that same space. We've got five loops on the hook. We're going to yarn over and pull through all the loops. And then I'm just going to chain two. 
I'm going to skip two and I'm going to make a US double, UK treble, just so that I can put my work down. And you can see those stitches now. So we've got a two, three, and four cluster, four stitch clusters. And you can just practice those um, as much as you like. They're, these are great little stitches. You'll see these are often used to make petals on flowers and things. And in the next uh, video, we'll be looking at how to make um, popcorns.